Hi, I'm Wayne Blanchard. I'm a certified financial planner and a member of the Garrett Planning Network. Today we're going to discuss FDIC bank deposit insurance information. Now, what is FDIC? That's the Federal Deposit Insurance Corporation. And what do they do? That's the government agency that backs all of the banks and you know, they're the ones that, that guarantee your deposits in the bank. So, what, uh, what do they really do? They, they will guarantee each depositor in a bank up to $250,000 right, per depositor, per bank, for each account ownership category. That would be a single account, a joint account, an IRA account, uh, any of those different kinds of things, those, those would be three, three different accounts, so each one would have $250,000 worth of protection. So that is what the FDIC insurance really takes care of. And so it's, uh, FDIC does not, this is something that you should really be, you should really make sure you understand because of the way things have gotten mixed around. Mutual funds, insurance policies, uh, uh, different kinds of investment products that are being sold by banks right now are not covered by FDIC insurance. Now some products, for example, um, insurance products have, do have some kind of state backing as a general rule. And your um, investment products have some products, uh, have some insurance based on a broker dealer that has what they call deposit insurance through that, but that mainly protects you in terms of a situation where that broker dealer would go out of business, not, it does not ensure that the investment would be good. So make sure you understand the distinction there. So we're talking about FDIC insurance insures bank deposits only.